these are already loose. So somebody was messing with this engine earlier. But anyway, this is one of four bolts that we're going to take off to remove this engine. This is number two. All right, so there are two more bolts like that that are on the other side. I won't bother videotaping that. But, uh, and then from there, we'll uh, disconnect the throttle cable and the electrical connection. All right, so uh, cut the two bolts out from the other side. And you'll see the whole engine is loose. So what we're going to do is to disconnect the throttle cable back there um, behind the on the other side by the carburetor disconnect the one electrical connection and this engine will be off all right all right so here we are we've got the engine loose Is take take this uh, kill switch off of here and then take this throttle off. So just a regular Phillips screwdriver. Just cut that wire. I won't be using it on the new, on the new Predator. But there it is. It's off. Again, not that we need this wire, but I don't know, spare parts might come in handy. All right, now we want to take this cover off. Take this off to get to the throttle. Okay, got the cover off, and now we will. Loosen up the throttle cable here. There we go. And there it is. Throttle cable's off. And the whole engine is disconnected. 